Hello again. We are going on with um, German historical victory. I mentioned in my previous video that first part of the game was going to be about developing Germany. To be fair, um, I was thinking that Riga is actually the capital of Latvia and I googled these two other cities and it turned out that Leibach is actually the German name for Ljubljana, which is the capital of Slovenia, and uh, Lemberg is a German word for Lviv, which is an Ukrainian city in West Ukraine. So these three cities are not actually in Germany, um, but um, if you see the stability map, I will put a link to it, uh, you'll see that they are not in, in red, they are Maybe they're not in dark green, but they're either in light green or in yellow, so it's still fine, it's still not an issue. Rome, by the way, is also in the yellow part of the stability map. I think that's because of the um, Holy Roman Empire that is also considered by the game, and, and also this this part of uh, Scandinavia, so Sweden, basically, um, is also in yellow, so that's not so bad. But France, Russia, England are all in red. Most of Greece is also in red. So you will have stability issues anyway. Okay, so we have a Lombowman here in two turns to help with the happiness problems this city has. We have another fish here. We could do a workboat later to get the fish. Um, and we're quite all right. We were ready for that attack from Spain. So that was good. I don't know if the Russians are going to attack me, but we have two longbowmen, crossbowmen, pikemen, swordsmen, axemen, spearmen. So not too bad. Maybe I replace a spearman for a pikeman instead of upgrading and wasting money. Okay, we have walls in Posen. We are definitely going to have a new university. And here we are also going to have a university. I forgot that I had education and I could do universities. So yeah, let's do university everywhere. And this guy also needs a um, lighthouse. Yeah, we can start with the lighthouse. That's fine. So the lighthouse is quite good because, oops, no, not first. Because it gives you, okay, wait, I'm doing things wrong. Um, Sorry, because it gives you extra trade routes, so or extra trade route threshold for the city, which is still good. Um, okay, so we're going for the liberalism race. We should get liberalism before everybody else because no one has education. Russia will not trade civil service, that's a shame. Neither will Spain. I really want civil service. You know, if the Turk wanted to make a trade with them. So yeah, I don't want literature from France or divine rights from Netherlands. They're too advanced already. I don't want to help them anymore. Let's do Hamlet here. Well, a cottage. Um, hmm. Everybody's unhappy. Open borders. Okay, I think it's you know, we always keep the the worst plague of the game, so you now we should be alright. Um, this guy can bow print in press. So if we bow print in press instead of getting it instead of getting it with um, liberalism, maybe we can get replaceable parts later. No, because I need banking. Okay, so I really can't get anything nice. Constitution, Constitution, seventy-five. I only need printing press for it, so I could get Constitution instead. Yeah, yeah. I will both print in press, and then I will use liberalism to get. Constitution, so I get the Taj Mahal. After I have, we're going to have to build a unit. So, well, these guys. 
Although in two turns I'm going to um, get some happiness. Mm -hmm. Let's do this. So too many happiness issues right now. Okay, still not terrible. We still can trade anything useful and they don't have enough money. Oh, this guy has money. The Ottoman Empire. What can we sell them? So okay, I'm going to invade you eventually to take Greece, but in the meantime, I could sell you copper. You already have iron, so I'm not really doing you any favors. You're also going to give me sheep, so that's fine. Some health is always good. And another turn. Who's the next guy who's going to get a specialist? That could be Riga or Posen eventually. Or Frankfurt eventually. Mm. You see? Spice, always spice with these guys. It's annoying. Too many angry people here. Okay, Frankfurt at least is not working any spice, so that's something. How about Lember? Okay, they're fine. I guess we can do a windmill here. So let's get some pigs. Stay there. Stay here. Lots of units, but we need them for happiness, so what are we going to do? Oh, the plague is here, it's also in Netherlands and France. Well, with the plague in Netherlands and France we really weren't going to skip it, so... Pikeman here, we'll get the university. This guy will get away from the city because I don't want him to get the plague. So the plague has arrived to Frankfurt. I think I probably lost the unit somehow. Um, yeah, people are not happy about that. Let's do a long bowman. Let's uh, grab this. I'm assuming Labour will get the play soon. Okay, every city has a play now. That's a little bit annoying. It's in city. Have a lot of unhappiness here. So, I'm going to do that this because obviously I lost a unit. Amphitheater in Lambert. Uh -huh. Do I have happiness issues? No, we have health issues. Which makes sense. Need to get a grocer, then barracks, and then maybe one more pikeman because if the Russian attack they're going to attack with horses. So this you already have Janissaries. Let me say have uh, gunpowder. Ooh. 
not very happy about that. Not particularly happy about that. Everybody has help out, apparently. That's interesting. Okay, we'll get liberalism very soon. Play has played in Gothenburg. The Russians and the Ottomans don't have it yet, which annoys me a little bit. This guy is probably going to die. And I'm probably going to lose a lot of units. Okay, let's see if I can keep at least one worker. Okay, the Ottoman have the have the plague. Open borders. Yes, at this point there's nothing to lose anymore. I opened my borders with France one turn too soon, apparently. Any society that will give up a little liberty to gain a little security. So yeah, the most expensive one is of course constitution. No, I'm not getting Commonwealth in this game. It's no good for me. And now we are going for uh, QS here. So I need military tradition, which means I need music literature. Uh, what else? Music literature, gunpowder, and civil service. So a lot of stuff that other civilizations already have. House in jail. My house in Riga. Jails are going to be very useful. They give us civility. Plus, um, they prevent war weariness. So they are very, very good. Okay, so we won the liberalism race, that's good. And now we're going to trade stuff. I hate to trade philosophy for literature only, but apparently it will have to happen because I don't want to give France so much stuff. Okay, let's see. France. They are friends, right? So, if I give you a printing press, then I want civil service, right? And literature. You will give me drama in five gold. Fine. Fine. Okay, so now all of the sudden, all of the sudden, this is the third tech I'm going to get after music, after music and gunpowder. I'll go to music first. Why? Because I might be able to trade gunpowder. That's why. Apparently Turkey is Christian instead of Muslim in this game, which is sort of um, unexpected. In tower. And Taj Mahal. This guy will stay here. This guy will heal. Okay, this worker died, and this worker needs to heal. 
There are meant to be more workers. I don't know if I will build them because I will get workers from Italy. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to build a theater, jail, stable, and only then we will build a university. Okay, okay, summer paras. No need to do the summer paras at this point. Stop the war against Portugal. I do not care about that. France is already okay. In terms of plague. Ooh, nice. Nice, but Spain is a better partner. Oh, wait, it's only one turn. Nah, I will wait one turn. Maybe later I can trade for... Um, for... Gunpowder. Yeah, that's fine. Of love. Lay on. University. Okay, wait, no, we have a lot of buildings again. No, I don't want to spy. Okay. And just now I'm realizing that I didn't do anything at all regarding espionage. So. Uh, I cannot put it on England. So, let's do this. Turkish are going to be invaded soon, France as well. The Vikings, not so soon. So, if we can do this. And. Um, yes, Netherlands, the most useful one. Okay. A German revolt is taking place in Venezia. That's unusual. Um, hmm. I'm definitely not keeping it if I get it from there. Uh -huh. So, of course, no one has what it takes to get a constitution, so I'm not going to push it as from how. This guy doesn't have paper or philosophy. Could get divine right from him. I'll be one for this. Mm -hmm. Too much. This time I'm actually going to leave the engineer because I would like to get the leaning tower. It's not about a wonder at all. How we doing the happiness? Uh, Regan Leibacher. Mm, serious risk. So actually Regan is going to be unhappy in no time. We don't have any... Yeah, we do. Theater, university, and jail are all good stuff. Way back, Ljubljana. Oh, they're going to get a theater right now, so that's good. Um, hmm. We could get one more unit here. Like um, this guy, for example. Those guys we can later move them around when we have when we get happiness resources. By the way, can I get happiness resources? Ooh, I can get gunpowder. 
that's interesting I cannot get any happiness resource all right fair enough um, we want to trade for gunpowder three turns oops that's not what I wanted to do let's see the other lands gunpowder something like 700 I don't think this will work, will it? No, of course not. So I already traded printing press with France. But that's a lot. Okay. If Netherlands becomes a serious competitor, I can always destroy them anyway. They will only have one city. And here we go, Curiosiers are coming. Can I get some money? Uh, no, I don't want to sell anything to France. Russia, I could sell them aesthetics or calendar. But 30 gold is nothing. Let's see next turn if they have something better. Abrazo so de Afel, French Empire, are at war. I don't. Okay, so I don't know who's at war with France, but I'm not going to get involved. That's for sure. Oh, so France is attacking Rome. That's fine, I'm going to destroy them anyway. Uh, and I still can get any nice amounts of money from anybody. So that's a shame. Okay. Let's see if we can mine this iron. If Russia doesn't attack me, I will be able to use it for some time. Doesn't look like Russia is going to attack me. Well, maybe they will. Okay. I have to be careful. I'm going to do a town here. The last is going for astronomy. I'm fine with that. I would like to get some money. Russia has 60 gold now. I can sell them calendar. Russia. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yeah, and that will also improve our relations. No, I won't. So you think 60 is a fair price for that, which is ridiculous. Push my house six turns, leading tower four. Mm -hmm. I can do this, which is totally going to happen. And I'm getting the leaning tower, which is great. Oh crap, Russia has declared war on me. Okay. Well, when you're playing Germany, it usually happens. That's why I put so many troops here, and then in Riga, we have a nice amount of troops as well. We have one pikeman here. Ooh, the fact that the guy is a pikeman is actually annoying. Can I attack him with this guy? Yeah, but I won't do so much damage. Okay, we're going to wait. But this guy is definitely going to get away from there. Let's go over here, we can make a cottage or something. Okay. Riga, these guys are not happy. It's too crowded. So, another one of these guys. 
distance. Let's remove the spy and put this here. And this guy actually as well. So the situation now with great people. Riga is going to be the next one. And uh, uh, great scientist or great engineer have the higher chances. I really hope I don't get a spy. The Vikings are already going for military tradition. Hmm. That's not bad at all for the Vikings. So this guy, 38. What if I do this? 56. It's kind of nice. But for the time being, I'm going to wait. Because if they don't try to pillage anything, there's really no point in me hurrying the attack. Obviously this guy has no chances. You know what, I am going to hurry the attack. I mean, I was lucky. Yeah, I didn't want to wait for them to have the chance of destroying me, so... Um, let's do this. Okay, we want to create a healer, the answer is yes, so here, let's do this, let's do this. And that guy needs to die as well. Okay. So I killed a lot of Russian people. Um, well, four units, but still okay. I think there's another army coming. They should have something better than that. And the second with the highest culture, not bad at all. Jail, okay. Jail is good. So, what else? Grocer. I do not need the health, but just improving my economy is always good. They want to waste two turns on a worker. The answer is no. You know what? I'm going to do with research. I really want military tradition as soon as possible. Oh, wow. Can't believe I got one of these guys. Okay, I definitely don't want either of these things. So I'm not going to use espionage in this game. I'm going to get a technological lead. So, so I'm going to keep this guy here. And uh, you need two great people for Golden Age. Uh, it's a nice thing to have the chance of doing a golden age anytime you want really okay, so this guy can come here I'm going to turn him into a medic and he's going to come here and wait and this unit will come here Olsen will have happiness issues very soon. So we can get a um, crossbowman. This guy can heal. This guy can go back home. Russia won't talk to me, of course. They are very angry with me because they declare war on me. So, <laughs> yeah. So, optics 777, yeah, I would have to be one of these two, and I don't want to. I have a monopoly on education and constitution, so I don't want to lose a monopoly. Oh, this guy has curious ears already. They are doing really well. So, nobody's at war with any, anybody. The Ottoman have a defensive pact with Russia. So that's very interesting. 
France does not have a defensive pact with anyone. That's important. So we're going to start with Italy, but yeah, not particularly happy at how good these guys are doing in this game. prefer the cathedral in Frankfurt for the culture there. See this? Yeah. So the war against Russia, why not? Okay. See what happens. Maybe the war finishes right now. If I'm lucky enough. Victorious warriors win Yay. first and then go to war, while defeated warriors go to so, war first and then seek to win. Now I want rifling for the cavalry and irreplaceable parts and banking. University in Lemberg. That's pretty cool. I guess I could do a market. Oh no, I need to start building Kiva's ears. I forgot about that. Okay, so what if you give me optics? Okay, so you offer me 5 gold per turn. I'm going to say yes. We are cautious. No. I'm your worst enemy. Spain and Portugal are at war. That's the only war that never ends. Portugal, you have optics. That's so nice of you. We're going to be very good friends. Open borders. Ooh, you could become a vassal state. 700. Mm, you know what? Let's put this in here. I'm going to give you civil service, um, philosophy and gunpowder. Oh, really? That's like a lot. Excellent. So. One doesn't discover new lands without losing sight okay. of the state. Vice royalty. So, vice royalty give me more stability for each vassal, plus four is a lot. So, if I can piss vassal a lot of people, this is going to be even better than occupation, okay? So, this is this is a choice you have to make in this game. And either you go with vice royalty or with occupation. You need one of these two. Occupation gives you plus two solidity points on city conquest, which you're going to be doing a lot. A non-negative stability points from cities under occupation, which is also very good for you when you're in Germany. The only problem is that it requires nationalism. And we are not going to research nationalism because you don't need it for curious here, and you don't need it for cavalry, and you don't need it for the panzer tanks. So you don't need it at all. <laughs> there is really uh, no need for that unless you want to get occupation. So you have to deviate from your normal research path. To get occupation, which is very annoying. I prefer to have peace vassals, but what about this? No, no, okay. Okay. Russia has a defensive pact with France. That's very annoying. We'll have to compensate for that with this. 
our spine. Yes, our Portugal. No, they could piss Vaso, but. That's not happening. At this point, I don't need this engineer anymore. Cross movement in three, and then we are going to start building cuirassiers. We already have stable, yes, we do. Okay. That's fine. Touch my hull in one turn. People are happy. I'm not happy, sorry. So we remove this, we put this, we do a theater, then a cathedral, and then we can start with cuirassiers, lay back, we'll do cuirassier. Okay, time to start building my army. This guy will build another cuirassier. Cool. So we'll build the army that will invade Italy. That part should be easy. Not very happy about France. Um, okay, have a lunch. I can do a revolution for no cost. Me and my kid. I will do this. It's free at this point where I will lose some money. Okay, that's fine. It's my favorite. I will try to make it happen. I need um, Spain and Portugal to stop being at war with each other so I can peace pass for Portugal and get that, that plus four. Wait, what? Why am I in anarchy? Oh, that's rubbish. So, we a revolution in the Golden Age. It's not free in this game. I completely forgot about that. You know, in the normal game you get it for free in all the Age, so I thought it worked in Rise and Fall as well. I didn't expect this. Okay, so the theater is coming and the cathedral is coming, so that's fine. 1520 AD. I need to have those lands by 1870s. So I have more than 300. And I have a total of 350 years. Okay. So, Forbidden Palace, War Wonder. Reduce maintenance in nearby cities. Okay, that's going to happen, just not there. And you have her here instead. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I will get it, but fail call wouldn't be too bad either. Wait two turns, I'm not going to rush something that's coming in two turns. Let's go here. I can build a mine over here. I think to remember there's going to be coal. Um, here or somewhere around this spot. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm just checking that the game doesn't, it's not giving me, oh come on again, this bloody Negative event. I hate it so much. Okay, so where is my doctor? My doctor is here. Send him to the 
front. Yep, this guy will come here. We have with the mine. By the moment we remove this forest, we are already going to be building, yeah, Forbidden Palace. France is also getting a storm, that's fine. That doesn't really bother me a lot. Okay, so what's the deal with banking? I can trade only with France. I'm obviously not interested in that. These guys have 90 gold, which isn't so bad. I could sell them something cheap like literature. Or I could sell drama to these guys. Okay, let's do it. Okay. Because, you know what? Even though I'm going to go to war with the disguise, they're so far behind that I don't mind. These Viking guys, even though they're going for military tradition, which is annoying. But it's still going to be easy. By the time I invite um, Scandinavia, I will probably have tanks already. So... Uh, the German tank is amazing, the Panzer is just a uh, total killer. There's no way they can defend from that. Okay, I'm going to build a mine there, even though it's not going to last for very long. Um, hmm. You know what, we are going to be at war in no time, so be annoyed if you want to be annoyed, I don't mind. But I would very much appreciate if you gave me your money. Okay. Nope, that's not going to happen. You are going to be at war with all of my enemies very soon, Banking because we have a defensive pact. So when everybody declares war on me, you are going to declare war on them, and it's going to be a world war, so... It's gonna be a lot of fun actually. Replaceable parts are coming. Okay, military science. Ooh. Yes, I do want this turkey. I want some happiness from you. Yeah, let's do that. So we have two longbowmen, one crossbowman. I have five units. Not yet, not yet, but it's coming. It's coming, the invasion of Italy is coming. Forbidden Palace, how are we doing with this? Mm, maybe I get it. It's not a bad wonder. And wonders give you stability, so they are always fine. That's too much money for only plus one. Until the end of the game. There are not going to be so many turns. No, no. I'm not going to do it. Let's do this. One turn. That's fine. Let's go here. Wait. Let's go here. Alright, so let's do the road. The Vikings are trying to get optics. France is trying to get replaceable parts. England has appeared again. Hello. Oh, I didn't know England before. That's funny. I could sell them um, nothing, apparently. Okay. Oh, farewell. 
to Rasier in Tolson. We can do a couple more. Stop the war, yes, stop the war against Portugal, please. I want the peace was on Portugal. It would be quite awesome if you stop that war. Okay, I think next turn, yeah, next turn I'm definitely invading Italy. And what's the situation? Okay, so England is not at war with the Vikings or with France or with anyone. So the defensive pack situation, uh, Turkey has it with Russia. So that's very bad because it means that when I invade France, I'm merely going to be at war with Turkey and with Russia. So I'm going to need a lot of units there. Um, hmm. And I have it with Spain and Netherlands. England doesn't have it with anyone. Okay. The Vikings don't have it with anyone. So that's better than nothing. And Portugal is at war with the Ottoman Empire. So let's see if the war stops. Not right now, no, but we are still at war, so the voting apparently didn't go well. Uh, and the French are still not able to invade Rome, they're pathetic, really. Okay, so these guys can go here, the medic can definitely go here as well. So the palace is coming. This guy can do another cottage. So to improve my economy. I should probably have done another worker. That was that was probably a mistake. Well is going for education. Well, it was a matter of time, I guess. Rush is going for gunpowder. Mm -hmm. Do I want to get all of this French money? Uh, no, not at this point, really. You know what? I think I will actually give you military tradition. Because you're going to be my war ally very soon. Okay, so. 63. If I do this, what happens? 69. Okay. Same situation here. And we in all the 69s. We have 71 now. If I do this, 75. And Venice. Venezia. Venezia. Venice will burn. And we'll burn. Okay, what can these two guys do? Approach Rome and heal. Or do they want to send them all the way to Rome? Okay, wait. How about these guys? Yeah, declare war, of course. How many units do we have here? Pikeman. Two Lombowmen, three Lombowmen, four Lombowmen. Wow, that's a lot of Okay, so let's go here. This guy can come here. These guys can come here, and I just won 
a worker. That's nice. That's nice. And these guys can come to war as well. I need to build a road here in order to connect Rome with the rest of my civilization. Mm -hmm. And call a spy. That's fine. Defensive buildings, we have everything we need. Oh, an observatory. I do want an observatory, but right now I really can't afford to have one. Oh, come on, stop putting spies there. This thing can be really annoying about that thing. Frankfurt, 10 turns. What are you giving me, Frankfurt? Let's do this. I didn't lose any turns, so yeah, let's do this. Uh, great scientist, 85%, that's good. Yeah, we are sending units this way. So, 10%, huh? And if we do this, 21, it's fine. 38. And if we do this, 27. This is starting to get annoying. I need to kill that penguin. It's really annoying me. 33. Okay. 66. Now we're tapping. 68. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. What? Ah, Sargon Dai Incon. Ah, Sargon, yeah. Great general, fine. I'm okay with that. Yay, what do we have? Apostolic Palace and Colosseum, as usual. More military unit production and the Apostolic Palace. We don't have the Church of Nativity, even though this is the sacred, I think this is the sacred city of Christianity. So we might want a great priest eventually. And we're going to do this. We're going to heal. And now let's send all of these guys here. And let's heal. Let's move. Where is my? Uh, oh, my medic is already there. So France has some units back here, and that's going to be annoying when it comes to time to attack them. Let's go here, let's get this guy here building a road, we have scientists, this is for scientific method, I really do not want to hurry scientific method, but I don't know, until I get it I cannot do anything else, we want the academy at this point in the game, it's probably too late for an academy. about joining the city. Okay, you know what? I will have this ready here. So if I need a golden age, I can make it for extra stability. And eventually I will want to research scientific methods, so I can always use it when the time comes. Portugal is still at war with everybody. That's fine. Okay, so what's going to happen when I attack France? We'll have people coming from here and here. They can attack Leibach and they can attack Lemberg. So, okay, I want to 
to really destroy France as soon as possible. Yeah, I'm going to just build a bloody huge armor. Armor, no, uh, army, sorry. And yeah, I'm going to destroy them. Will I wait for cavalry? Maybe. France is not even getting replaceable parts yet, so. I want to get rifling before they get replaceable parts. Okay. Hello, Aztecs. I have no idea how that happened. But I am in contact with them. So that's um, hilarious, I guess. Okay, so. Um, I could sell philosophy to the Vikings or optics to the Turk. It's not a lot of money, though. Ah, the Essek are a vassal state of Netherlands, that's why I know them. Okay, fine. So apparently, Spain did not get the Essek land. Now let's reconsider, let them go back to the land. These people need to heal. Um, this requires a mine. This requires a quarry. I guess I can do the quarry first. I already have a lot of iron. I have so much. Okay. I don't have so much marble. Thing before invading France, I'm going to do another pause. I have more than 200, almost 300 years left in order to attack France, so it shouldn't really be so hard. Okay, wait and wait. Christianity has spread in London. Everybody is Christian in this game. Even the Ottoman Empire is Christian. So, yeah. Do these guys have a castle? Yes, they do. Have a Riga? Yes, they do. It's fine. Okay, so one guy is going to stay behind. I guess. This guy will stay behind. Everybody else will go to war against France. So this very nice army could be enough to for units only. It could be enough to destroy Marseille. Oh, this guy is in German land. That's interesting. I just got wine. That's one happiness. So that's good. Curious here. There's a bunch of them. And to need a bunch of them. Okay, let's prepare everything for the invasion of France. France has proven the war is round. Good for them. One last nice thing before they get completely destroyed. So I'll do a windmill here. Replaceable parts is going to make those windmills really good. Water mills as well. So let's build them. Mm -hmm. Rifling is coming. 
and then I will walk the long road towards industrialism. You know what? Let's do this just in case. I don't want any surprises. Another bunch of these guys. Four turns for rifling, five turns for curas here. Okay. That means it's going to be a cavalry after all. Who was the next one? Frankfurt. We are still going to get a scientist. Apparently we are. You know what? Let's put priests there. Because I actually do want to have We're still getting roughly in four terms. I actually do want to have the Church of Nativity. It's um, quite a good um, building to have in this game. Okay, so we have uh, one Curiosity here. We are going to have Curiosity there. I would like to recover contact with Spain before starting this war. So I am going to do it actually. So one of these guys will go here and say hello to Spain. And he's actually going to attack no, he's not going to attack from Spain because he's too far. Okay. We have five guys here. And a lot of them here. Only two units in Marseille. Almost too easy. They're improving the land for me, which is great. He's furious for me because he's Muslim. Mm, and I'm Christian. Ascetics for gold. Yeah. No, he's not so furious anymore. Once I won one turn worth of money, he's not going to trade our money, everybody with me. That's a real shame. Postal para, para selection, Bismarck. Tex. France has a lot of money. I might want to make peace with them after I destroy a bunch of cities of course hmm. well this is gonna be fun so okay what if you stop being friends or Russia what if you stop being friends no. Okay, let's wait. Russia has some money I could sell fish. And I cannot sell anything to Turkey, but I could sell something to the Vikings. What if I give you a cup? Will you give me your money? Yes, you will. Russia would probably give me some money as well. Yeah, that's nine extra gold per turn. Not too bad. Mm, 
Ok. So. There's not really much more I can do here. But we can build another cottage here. One curious here will stay here in Lemberg. Cavalry is coming, it's time for a pause. We will go on later. <laughs>